feel it felt fine. It felt I, I, I wasn't nervous. It, it was. Yeah. It was a different audience. And, you know, opening night audience was a little bit more subdued than usual. People, people are very profoundly affected by the play, and we we hear that and feel that. It was a little bit more subdued tonight, but and yet afterwards, you know, the feedback I'm getting from people shows that they were very affected by it. It wasn't quite as apparent on the stage, but you know, we're all so confident in our parts and our performance in the play that. Um, it doesn't really matter, <laughs> you know. Talk about working with Moises Kaufman. Oh, he's a very profound person. He's got a huge soul, a very accessible soul that you can see in the play. And he's not afraid of being collaborative. He allows feedback from the actors. And um, it's, a, it's, a, it's just a very pleasurable, easy relationship that I've had with him. You have a wonderful ensemble. This is an ensemble piece with a wonderful group of ensemble. What is it like playing the show with these wonderful actors, including Samantha and Colin? Yeah, oh, we all love each other a lot. And uh, one of the things that I'm so happy about with the play is that it is an ensemble. You know, it doesn't rest on any of our shoulders individually. We're all, we're all together. We interact together. But it's not just the actors. It's also the sets, the lighting, you know, the special effects. Um, all kind of carry us along. But, you know, Samantha, I love her being my daughter. It's very wonderful to play with her, looking into her face and... and playing with Colin? And, yeah, well, you can't not love him, you know. He's just so lovable. Audiences love him. Tell me what it was like doing the Easter Bonnet. We do it every year. What was it like for you being a part of that and raising so much money for this wonderful cause? You know, I, I've i never experienced it, so I, I didn't know what the end result would be. I didn't know how our skit would compare to other skits, but Michael Winther came up with this idea, and all, we like each other so much, all of us in the cast, that it was just another good excuse for us to get together and, and have fun and fool around. And Michael did such a great job. Um, Making it all happen. I mean, he just did. He did everything. He did everything. And uh, and as far as the fundraising, you know, it's what I do. It's I, I do it all the time. And because of the nature of our show, I'm I'm talking to the audience all during the evening, right? Plus, I'm really really sick. So after the curtain, when this sick person comes out and continues talking to them, and then. We discovered an added little dollop of fun. We found out that we were about two shows behind Wicked. And so I would tell the audience that and just say, you know, it's never happened that a theater this size raise more money than a theater like the one Wicked is in. Help us beat Wicked. And uh, audiences really got into it. And so we, we started raising a lot of money. In addition to that, um, I would invite people up on stage to take pictures with me. And I auctioned off books. And so it just, you know, we, we had a feeling that maybe we were going to make history in that way. Well, you did. And, and we did, yeah. Let's talk about being a part of this theater season, because it's been many years. And you and I spoke very early on during the rehearsal process. I never... In my while, I'm glad I'm wearing glasses. I'm wearing glasses because I have this thing that it's called ep episcleritis, and it just happened. It looks like we're all liver, so I'm going to keep my glasses on, which will also cover the fact that I'll probably cry because a week from today I'm gone, and it's been the most extraordinary experience, more than I ever could have imagined. I've had such a good time, just wonderful. Thank you for bringing. Your joy to Broadway, raising so much money for Broadway Cares, but just being here, it's and been... Then, oh, I didn't say the excitement of actually being at the event that day in that theater. It was unbelievable. I couldn't... All these people and everybody was so filled with love and, and excitement. It was amazing.